What up, it's Melvin7 here bringing you episode 8 of my Let's Play FIFA 20 Ultimate Team series. And today we're going to be completing this Rafinha Team of the Season Moments card. Um, yeah, spoiler, if you want to watch yesterday's episode where I got the best pack I've ever got on FIFA 20, it's worth the most coins of anything I've ever packed across any FIFA Ultimate Team. So that's from FIFA 11 all the way to 20. My best pack was yesterday. So I'm going to spoil it now, so... You know, if, if you haven't seen it, go and check it out. But we did get Neymar in the reissued re uh, Team of the Season guarantee. So, yeah, uh, I've, I've started the, this objective already. Um, th these two bits are going to be so easy now. I mean, using Brazilian players with 82 plus dribbling. I have tons and now I have Neymar. So, yeah, I just need to get the wins with that. Um, as you can see, I've already scored five of the League One players with minimum four-star skill moves. Take a guess who I've used to do that. These two were the ones I was trying to get out of the way ASAP because I, I, I kind of be asked to go and buy someone on the market. So I just use players in my club. Uh, I'll show you how I've done that now. Uh, same with this one, the max three star week foot. I, I traded in a few players for the deluxe and the ultimate guarantees and everything. So I had like Team of Season Vinicius who I was using for three star week foot, but I got rid of him. So in the end, in order to do those objectives, uh, this is the, the squad that I'm going to be running. I'm going to change it a bit now that I've done the two uh, little crappy ones. Because I was using Rodrigo for the three-star weak foot. As you can see, two goals, one assist in three games. And then I was bringing on Morega straight away just to get the assist and then subbing him back off. Because he's the Liga NOS player. So I can get rid of him now. Uh, I was going to use Traore if I needed to because he's got one-star weak foot. But thankfully, I didn't need to. So... I want your guys' help as well in the comments section, if you can. Can you suggest me a way that I can get this team? Um, I'll, I'll show you my main, main team, actually. Uh, which which of the players I actually want to get um, into the start next XI. Like, the best way I can do it with chemistry... Um, right, I'll go to my main team. Because that, that's what I'm using for the objectives. Because obviously you just need a bunch of Brazilian players. And I want to use some of the Brazilian cards because they're really good. But basically I want to start with this. Um, so in game it would be a 4-2-3-1. Uh, but basically I want those players to be in my team. So uh, if I go to formation. I'll put them in the formation that I want. Uh, so that ideally in game. So in, oh, bloody hell, man. I, I prefer FIFA 19's um, way of navigating the menus. It's much easier, but anyway, right. So in game, I would want it to look something like this. Well, if I can actually move the players. Oh, my days, right. Modric come down here. So I would want it to be something like that in game. Um, obviously, you know, I can make subs, I can do whatever, but I, I, I want to try and get all of these players in with as minimal fuss as possible. Uh, so that's what I want it to be in game, my main team when I play champs this weekend, if the rewards are any good, obviously. Uh, so yeah, that's what I want to end up with. If you guys can figure out a way for me to get perfect chemistry with these players or what I need to do, etc. I don't know whether to get Alexandro. Um, and then obviously play Neymar on the left mid and then get a Brazilian cam or go and get SPC Allen or so. I, I, I don't know, but basically I want to have fun and these are my favourite players to use. So this is the team that I want to rock. But anyhow, enough talking. We'll get into some Neymar highlights now. He is absolutely incredible. Considering um, I've literally been trying to force the ball to Rodrigo and Morega, the fact that he has seven goals and one assists one assist is just incredible like honestly i've been forcing the ball all the time to crap players uh so as soon as neymar gets it, i'm just passing it off but now I'll, I'll show you stats after i get the the rafinha card and yeah he, he'll just he'll blow them out of the water there's just something special there's a reason he's worth four and a half million coins and i'm so happy to get him but anyway enough of that let's get into the highlights neymar was an absolute joy to play with I'm so happy I got him. Honestly, he was one of the ones that I really, really wanted. Um, I want to see if I can incorporate Awa into the team at any point as well, because I think he is a phenomenal card. And obviously, League One, you know, he gets a soft link to Neymar. But 
Uh, it, it just the the things this this car can do is absolutely incredible. Like the, the way he dribbles, his close, concise. Uh, the way he pulls off his skill moves, uh, the ability to like power a shot straight away. It's yeah, there's a reason he's four and a half million on the market. But anyhow, in terms of um, my video and streaming schedule and stuff, tomorrow the video will be a bit later than 5 pm because of the Summer Heat promo. I want to you know do a video on that because it looks as though there'll be a few milestones, uh, a few upgrades, etc. It looks like an exciting end to FIFA 20, to be fair. Uh, obviously, EA Play happens on Friday, I believe, so we'll get a little bit of information about FIFA 21. Probably not any Ultimate Team stuff until you know at least July, maybe August, but at the same uh, time. Um, you know there will be something so anyhow uh, tomorrow I will upload after 6 p.m. Uh, probably about 8 p.m. because I am streaming tomorrow uh, straight away at 6 p.m. Uh, GMT or BST time so it's it's the UK time I'll be streaming at 6 p.m. Uh, for an hour or two just you know see what's what's going on with it so it'd be nice to see you in the twitch uh, stream at that point um, and then yeah, obviously the video will be uploaded anyway after if you know you're you're otherwise occupied or whatever you just want the video. Uh, on Thursday I will also be streaming um, four sets of rewards. Uh, I'll have my own, which unfortunately this week I only got silver one, which is a little bit of a shame. I should have done better, but I I rushed my games and I just uh, I, I collapsed to be honest. So you know there's no real excuse for it. It was just terrible on my point uh, part. So yeah, I've got silver one, but I do have. Um, gold 1 rewards gold 3 rewards and gold 2 rewards I think uh, from 3 of my followers on uh, twitch slash twitter so you know that'll be really really good uh, hopefully we can get them some good stuff obviously last week we didn't really get um, Tom anything good which was a little bit of a shame but yeah I can upload the highlights to, for that on Thursday as well if there's nothing for summer heat I, I just I don't know, I, I might have play around with my upload schedule, like change it from 5pm on certain days. I don't know, because obviously the content drops at 6pm and the idea was I would do the content the day after and upload it. But sometimes, you know, obviously it's better on the day. So I'm not entirely sure what Thursday's video will be, but I would imagine I'll still upload at 5pm and I'll probably have some summer heat stuff after that. Um... You know, for the rewards and everything, I'll probably make the video on Monday. Um, but yeah, uh, um, I'm now a Twitch affiliate, so I have some custom emotes on there too, which I can debut tomorrow in a video if you want, because I, I think they're absolutely phenomenal. Like, uh, I'm not gonna lie, I absolutely love the Twitch emotes, and um, you know, the the person, the graphics designer who made those is absolutely phenomenal, and he's on a website called Fiverr, which is uh, for you know a bunch of creative people can sell uh, their skills and expertise and uh, design you really cool stuff so yeah eventually I'll get a new YouTube banner as well but I'm going to wait until FIFA 21 because it's pointless making one for FIFA 20 given it's the end of the game I am aware that my banner currently says FIFA 17 but yeah again it's it's absolutely pointless to change that right now so that will be underway you know I, I'm excited I'm excited to you know launch a proper brand like not just YouTube with Twitch, with you know everything, eventually maybe have merch that sort of thing. Um, so you know, thank you for staying with the channel, for sticking with it. Twitter, FIFA 21 will be much better, um, but hopefully Summer Heat can give a little bit of fun and you know spark a little bit of excitement right before the release of FIFA 21. But yeah, I, I'm just thoroughly happy with the support I'm receiving, and uh, thanks for watching, pretty much. Um, back to the actual gameplay like yeah there's there's not much else I can say about Neymar I just hope I get Mbappe in my reds so then I can get a strong link and I can play those two up front but yeah he, he's he's just brilliant he really is like some of the highlights here I, I know they're fairly simplistic things at times but this one I think coming up right now is probably my favourite uh, is it this one I'm trying to think I think it is yeah it is it, it's just like a little dink little drag back and bang like just it, the the way he dribbles the ball it's just it really is exceptional and uh, yeah we did manage to get the Rafinha card which you'll see in a sec anyway uh, when I you know end the 
in this little highlight section but yeah I think in 22 games Neymar scored 22 goals and had 11 assists and some of those were obviously things where I was trying to get the other terrible objectives for this Rafinha card so yeah what up it's Melvin 7th here and I've just done this section and it didn't record so I did redeem the um, the Rafinha moments Rafinha but you can't see me redeeming that but hey ho he is done um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with the card, if I'm going to use him or not. Um, obviously, he'll get a strong link to Neymar, uh, so I can put Neymar up front, and then, you know, uh, I can change the formation and have Rafinha on the left or on the right. Um, I, I, I really don't know. I need some help uh, from you guys. But yeah, Neymar is by far the best player I've used this FIFA. He's just absolutely insane. Like... Uh, Considering I'm a bang average player, that is mad. He's got a goal and like a goal and a half. Sorry, a goal contribution and a half every single game. It, it's it's incredible. And again, I've been you know forcing the ball for a few of those games and just I don't know. He's just absolutely insane. But yeah, we'll see what I'm going to do with this Rafinha. Um, he's probably going to be a card like Jack Grealish, where you know I, I'm excited to get him and I think he's going to be class. And then he turns out to be pretty dog shit to be honest this Grealish card is not very good um, I didn't enjoy him very much so yeah that's why I don't really use him and I'll probably use him during summer heat if they've got any SBCs my favorite card before Neymar was definitely Bruno Fernandes and I'm really hoping that they give him an upgrade during summer heat or a new card so he can compete with these team this season level players because you know a five upgrade for this card and he'll be right up there near on where Neymar is to be honest because he's just perfect for this game but anyhow uh, I might have a foot draft at the end of this video if I don't then this will be the last bit so yeah I'll be back tomorrow the video will be later because I'll be streaming summer heat at 6 p.m then I'll be uploading whatever the highlights are then so I'll see you then hopefully you have enjoyed and peace